Hello tubers, welcome to this episode of Take the Fear Out of the Gear with me, Joe's Bangers. And me, Mr Chumley Warner. And I'm going to hand you over to Chumley because he's going to explain something which I know nothing about because he's the magic man, magic man. What it is, we've uh, we've dug up a piece of video which we thought you might find interesting. It's about a Yamaha SY85 keyboard, and what we've done, it's replacing the floppy disk drive. Sorry, I just stop you there. What? What? Who's done? We've. We've. Yeah. I had nothing to do with it. You did it all yourself. <laughs> I can't take no credit. What Simon's done? Here we have a Yamaha SY85. I just turned it upside down because uh, we need to take all the screws out of the bottom. Right, all the screws have been removed. Put them in a logical manner and take off the back cover. And here's the inside. Now we're going to be going over to the left hand side. I'm going to take out these four screws. Uh, but before that, screw there and a screw there first. Yeah, so we've taken out a screw there and a screw there. Get your disk drive out. Take, carefully take the four screws from the top. Well, this is the disk drive. And then I'll be carefully taking the ribbon connector out. All right, that's those four screws. And you can see the bottom of the drive here. The problem, main problem with the drives are is the drive belt gets old and stretches. And I've actually replaced this one with the proper belt. But it still doesn't seem, want to seem to play ball. So I'm going to try and swap it out for a different drive. What we have here is a modern drive this is a direct drive so there's no belts this is a panasonic drive which was recommended and you can see from ebay i bought an adapter that slots in the back of the new floppy drive and then the ribbon cable from the old drive should go straight in the back now here we go i'm just holding the disk drive on top for the moment just to test it put a blank disk in you can't see the display but it says it's formatting 62 percent 75 i'll see if we can it formats the disk and then i'll get a, a disk with sounds on and see if we can load the only thing we might have to do is might have to modify the piece of metal bad disk that's not a good start panasonic drive ju 256a198 pc there's either a fault with this drive or it's just not compatible pulled an old sony drive out of a pc which i think is one of the recommended one it's a mpf 520m i formatted the disc and loaded one of the factory discs so i'll just try and see how it will fit in now we've had to do a couple of modifications to the uh, metal piece we've had to cut a slot because the extra board on the back so it comes out and drilled a hole to make it easier for the power lead to go in as well like that and it should fit in perfectly now new disk drive is in that's the sony one panasonic didn't seem to work they're just loading the groove factory there we have it it's just said completed and yeah there it is groove factory so I take the disk out grab a blank disk stick a blank disk in easiest way is to get a menu flick it over to number 10 format press yes disk format are you sure here we go there we go up to 87 percent now almost there completed amazing Another formatted disc. SY85 seems to be in back in working order. 